The Lagos State Government says it acknowledges the important roles the private sector and non-state actors play in the socio-economic development of the state and the country. Deputy Governor of Lagos, Obafemi Hamzat, said this at the commissioning of the newly renovated pediatric center of the Bagada General Hospital by Rotary Club of Bagada and the George Charitable Foundation. The Deputy Governor, who was represented by the Secretary to the State Governor, Pimbola Salu Hundein, said the government will continue to provide the enabling environment for such organizations to thrive. Details in this report. The pediatric center of the Bagada General Hospital was built by the Rotary Club of Bagada over 30 years ago and has undergone refurbishment over time. This time around, the center has got a facelift thanks to the partnership between the Rotary Club of Bagada and the George Charitable Foundation. I hereby present this appreciation award to the George Charitable Foundation. Representatives of the Lagos State Government, particularly the Health Ministry, are gathered here. The State Health Service Commission says the commissioning is a formality as the center has been put to use since November last year. The commission also says it represents another milestone in their ongoing efforts to enhance in healthcare delivery in Lagos. This donation is much more than just a piece of a building or an equipment or an outfit within a department. It is indeed a symbol of compassion, solidarity, and a shared commitment to the well-being of our children and our community. As the SSG takes a tour around the facility, she is appreciative of the Rotary Club for its continued support in pushing the state forward with regular interventions. This partnership to me aims to provide quality healthcare delivery to our children and improve the quality of life of our citizens. This shows that these two organizations' commitment to maternal and child health care is worthy of emulation. It is on this premise that I therefore commend and appreciate the leadership and members of these non-profit organizations for the foresight and initiative of renovating and expanding the children's ward of this hospital. The district governor and club president, as well as the partner, share the vision behind the project and plans to ensure sustainability. So we always monitor to be sure that the children, that the ward is supposed to take care of, that they're actually being taken care of. And when we donate things, we follow up to make sure that the things are actually given out freely too, the way we have given it freely, because we don't charge money for whatever things we do. So if we can embark on a 30 million Naira project and give it freely, we want to also ensure that the children of this community are benefiting from it and um, they are getting free services too. It's saving the child of the world. This is children's ward, pediatric ward, as you may call it. And um, you save a child, you save the world. That's the way it is. So it's open not only to Bagada community, but to the entire Lagos State community. We've done a great work here. We have the emergency session of it. We have the outpatient and we have the inpatient. We have a room for the mother and we have a room for the mental aspect of um, life for the mother. Uh, basically, it's uh, to give back to society, to assist our fellow citizens, to support Lagos State, to do good, to help with the development of the country. This gesture will no doubt help in the delivery of efficient health care for children in the state as the globe hopes for continued support and partnership from the government. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.